Welcome ladies and gentlemen to another League of Legends Ranked video. Uh, this game is played in the Silver Elo and uh, I got to pick a jungler. Um, <laughs> surprisingly after I picked, uh, I picked a filler and uh, the jungler I chose for this game was uh, Nunu. Uh, and the reason for that being is that I believe that he's a number one. He's really underplayed, uh, and number two is that he has a very huge ganking potential, <laughs> is what I've noticed. Uh, so uh, for the runes, I am running half AP and half uh, ma uh, half tank uh, uh, for AP in my runes. I'm going for magic pen seven point eight. Armor 7.0, ability power, uh, flat ability power actually 9.7, uh, flat magic resist 8.0, and greater ab uh, ability power scaling, um, simply because I want to get some uh, some ability power per level. Uh, and for the masteries, masteries are tank masteries, uh, cunning in 12. And in Resolve is 18 with the Keystone of Choice uh, being Strength of the Ages. Uh, and the reason for that being is that, of course, Nunu being such an easy jungler, uh, born to jungle, you get uh, tanky really quickly and... I've noticed something when playing Nunu is that uh, your clearing is really uh, overpowered. <laughs> uh, you get to level up really quickly in the jungle with <laughs> Nunu. And you'll notice that very, uh, very quickly in this game. And uh, quicker clearing also equals uh, quicker uh, ganking times. So that's something to take in consideration. Uh, usually a build, I decide to go Nunu for early game. Uh, for an item, I try to go for the green, um, for the green jungler's item, the warding uh, jungler's item, the ward one. Um, Hunter Talisman for a starter, that's why uh, it also gives me a quick, uh, for the faster level up. Uh, and like I said, he has uh, a quick clear jungle because of his Q. Um, and higher sustain, I noticed that in this game, uh, I had um, a hard time backing. <laughs> because I was everywhere. Um, I had a, a large amount of gold when backing, which also meant that I was buying um, my uh, finished items... Uh, very quickly. Uh, so of course, if I'm not mistaken, there uh, the enemy jungler in this game was a Yi. Um, sorry, the audio. Uh, once again, I apologize for the audio. It's not uh, recorded in uh, real time. It's uh, it has been recorded right after the game. So since Nunu uh, does consume mana, and uh, even it. Even because of his passive, his passive is hit four times, and the next skill is um, is free. Uh, he still consumes a lot of mana, so that's why I decided to start on the blue side. And Bard there has decided to also help me. Um, kudos to him, which will also give me even greater sustain. As you can see, I'm already at half health because of the blue, but uh, thanks to that uh, Bard shrine, I'll. Uh, regenerate back to full health and uh, the smaller golems here also will regenerate me back to full health as you can see there we go almost back to full health um, after that I decided uh, I could have went for the wolves but uh, instead I decided to go for the rift scuttle um, and if I noticed uh, that there was a little bit of action going bot uh, yeah, the <laughs> the enemies were pretty low, um, which is at this point is why I kind of regret it not going for the wolves um, to get my level three. Uh, 
uh, which is exactly what I'm gonna do now. Like I said, I'm gonna have uh, I'm gonna be late. I thought I uh, actually was late in ganking bot because I went for the uh, rift scuttle. Uh, there's a lot of action going on bot. They're really <laughs> uh, they're really going uh, aggro. They're and I guess that would be the perfect time for me to gank bot, which is what I did exactly at this point. Um, Nunu is a pretty slow jungler, 361 movement speed. And uh, here we go, this is where I come in. Uh, I activated my ghost. Bard also helps. Um, and the quicker I am, you're gonna see they're gonna, uh, they're gonna, boom, boom, they're gonna burn. Uh, you just saw it right now. Both flashes and heal. Uh, the Jinx thought she was going to die, but uh, they actually burned really good assets. And uh, you've actually noticed that I don't have like a TP or a flash when playing in the jungle. I have a ghost, and that's all. Uh, that's a big reason because um, whenever I gank, I believe that the faster you are at ganking. Uh, the quicker you'll get a kill or you'll help your ally get a kill so that's why I use ghost and it's a faster way to catch up because uh, for example if uh, you go to gank your um, go to gank and it's warded uh, usually in the in the early game you're you're, you're pretty slow you don't have a, a, a pretty fast paced um, a fast paced movement speed so that's why the ghost is there as well uh, another thing I've noticed with <laughs> a good thing actually with Nunu is uh, of course his um, ability uh, to get mini buffs uh, the mini buffs is when you use your Q you have uh, three of the sort uh, bottom lane just had a kill over there and this game is starting off pretty well and you'll notice that this is one of my best games yet uh, played with Nunu um, and as stated before not a lot of people at this elo play <laughs> Nunu uh, and that's pretty good because they don't really uh, expect uh, a high uh, like an underplayed champion to be that good but uh, that's why that's why uh, you should always know uh, which <laughs> which champion you're playing against. Uh, for now, I have cleared all of my jungle, um, and like I said, Nunu has a lot of sustain. Um, and if you look at the mini buffs I've got on there, I have the um, I have the wolf. Uh, which I believe um, upgrades uh, my armor, gives me higher armor. Uh, I have uh, growth, which was which is still in action because of the red buff. Um, I don't have um, I don't have the uh, the last one, which I can't really remember. Um, you'll notice in this game that bot lane is going to tend to uh, over push a lot. And here I am with the bard coming in for the gank. We're gonna come in and kill the Jinx. The Ezreal knows actually what we're gonna do. I think he spotted us really well. And here we go. That's how the Ezreal got a kill. And thanks to the Bard, <laughs> Bard really did a really good job on there on that gank. Um, he made it really easier for me to go in and uh, pull in my E. Uh, you also notice that I went in early for uh, a dragon simply because I'm Nunu. Um, they've actually noticed it. It was actually warded. Uh, they're gonna try for an early team fight. Uh, I thought we were all gonna die, but no, not actually. They're gonna start doing dragon. Uh, I also felt kind of bad uh, for giving them dragon. I thought the Garing was also going to uh, use his teleport, but no. Actually, here the Tresh grabbed uh, the Ezreal. And the Yi went in for the kill. The the Yi got greedy actually, which let us uh, do uh, get a few more kills. And we are, and we're actually continuing. Uh, we're we're gonna pretty much get greedy over here, but no. Um, actually, because of that grab and because both Thresh and uh, the Master Yi got greedy, 
we managed to pull off uh, three kills. The Yi, the Tresh, and uh, the Zillion, and thank God the Red just respawned. Um, so yeah, uh, I believe that they should have uh, continued doing Dragon without trying to get too greedy. Uh, the Ezra was a little bit uh, was a little bit in their face, so I believe that's why they kind of did what they what, uh, kind of believe what the Tresh had to do. Um, but E should shouldn't have probably Alpha Strike. They should have probably focused on Dragon. I mean, one Tresh, dra uh, one champion dying for Dragon. I believe that's worth. Um, so like I, so right now I'm I'm probably at two K gold. Uh, I wanted to back here, but um, I saw an opportunity at bottom lane uh, to gank them. That's exactly what I did. The Jinx was over pushing again, and there you go. The Bard, Magical Journey, uh, journeys me in. There you go. I, I'm able to hit my E. She actually healed and got scared of me. No, we didn't actually heal them. <laughs> um... If I remember correctly, I oh the E was coming. A three-man gang bot. Yeah, this is where we're probably gonna kill them. I think uh, the E uh, is trying to find an opportunity for kills, uh, but can't quite get them. Uh, we managed to uh, pick off the Jinx and uh, the Zillion also as well tried to stun me. Uh, didn't quite manage to do it and uh, right now I'm at 2.3k gold like I said with the new new I um, I don't know if I noticed this and but in general when I play new new uh, I have a tendency of getting too much gold and like I said really good thing about uh, about uh, whenever I play new new is that since I have too much gold on my uh, on my hands, uh, it lets me uh, instantly buy the items I want. Um, currently, right now, I'm 005. Uh, we also have no, we didn't do dragon yet, but I believe I'll do it pretty soon. And right now, I kind of lost all my buffs. Uh, I'm gonna try to get them back. Um, I got the growth back but I should get the uh, I should get the wolves one back and the mystery meat and the yeah now I remember the uh, uh, the last the last third one was a uh, mystery meat um, Bird was probably trying to go in for a kill he thought the asshole was gonna follow up but he didn't um, also notice that I'm maxing my Q really important because that's what you use to gank a lot um, I could have, um, usually if I'm doing badly, oh, wait a minute, I'm going to go in for the gank. The Garen just teleported. Um, I'm going to go in for the Tresh. Thank you, Bard, for giving me that kill. They kill off the Jinx. So, yeah, really important uh, thing to do with Nunu is uh, to max your E first. That's what you're using to, uh, uh, to gank in the early game. Um, if... I got counter jungle. Uh, on the contrary, if I ever get counter jungle and I'm performing really badly, um, I'll have a tendency to max the Q first for more survivability and for more farming options to get my items a lot quicker. Uh, so we get dragon, uh, and now I'm going. Uh, I'm gonna go back to uh, get my buffs. I got the mystery meat going on. Uh, my growth is almost done. Uh, so we got Dragon managed to get off a few turrets. Uh, the Asso kind of died, but I, uh, I believe they destroyed Top, or Top was already destroyed before Yasso died. Uh, I'm not really sure, but anyways, uh, I just noticed that if I got that uh, green, uh, the green jungle item, uh, there was no need to me to have my uh, warding trinket, so I went for the sweeper, um, and. You'll probably be wondering why I decided to take uh, the um, the cooldown reduction uh, boots is because uh, of my ultimate. My ultimate uh, takes a lot of time to uh, come off cooldown. I, I believe it's at 123 or 130 
uh, off of cooldown. Uh, so in this game, the balance I'm trying to uh, to do is uh, is I believe I have a lot of armor, uh, some cooldown reduction, and a lot of movement speed. A lot of movement speed as well. Um, here it here it is. We're gonna try to go in for the gank. Uh, Bard manages to pull off uh, a, s a slow, but the Jinx kind of <laughs> ran away. Um, I could have dove there, got greedy for, uh, gotten greedy for a kill, but I don't really think it's worth it. Um, as long as we get the objectives done. It is something really funny. Uh, staying in the bushes, killing that zillion. He actually fell for it. Um, really good positioning as well from the Bard. The Bard is really good in this game. Uh, Israel again, once again, manages to kill off Jinx. Uh, the Bard <laughs> lets me the kill, and we manage to uh, we manage to uh, take away another turret, which is pretty good as well. Um, their team is actually performing really bad, mainly because of bad, um, I guess, bad decision making as well. Um, I don't think that at this point, I uh, I don't think that at this point in the game that they've warded their jungle. I don't think that their jungle is warded or semi warded, I guess. Um, and also considering that it's uh, two, uh, two kills to uh, thirteen kills uh, from for us. Um, I think that they're pretty much on tilt right now, which is really bad when that happens. Um, when you see that there's an advantage going on, uh, and here it is, another team fight. The bard tries to go in. I manage to. Uh, we kind of get stunned by the zillion here. Uh, I try to kill the trash, but I back off instantly because I saw the yi. Uh, who was going for the for the Ezreal? I thought maybe try to protect them. The Bard died though uh, during in that stun, uh, and unfortunately, I didn't have my. All, I believe it was like eight seconds down. Um, but yeah, when usually when uh, other players go on tilt, um, when it's like something like three, uh, four to fourteen actually now. Um, other players have a tendency to go on tilt. Um, the best thing to do is just calm down. Um, you know, it it's kind of kind of might seem tough whenever I say it, but really just try to calm down. I've been on tilt before as well, but whenever I know that it's it's happening, I try to calm down and try to find other options. Uh, the Jinx is zero five. In every single game scenario, you can still come back from from uh, from another game. And uh, Argarin, <laughs> Argarin is getting pretty salty. <laughs> uh, taunting them as well. Um, a good thing with Nuno as well is that he's a constant jungler, and what I mean by that is that sometimes at some points uh, during the late game, uh, the jungler doesn't really become a jungler anymore. Uh, Nunu stays a jungler from beginning to end uh, thanks to his little small buffs that he gets from the jungle, uh, from his Q uh, actually, yeah, that, that he actually gets from the jungle. Uh, and here it is, they've actually... <laughs> They, uh, they kind of caught me, but uh, they couldn't quite grab me, so uh, if you notice, the Tresh missed his flay, actually. And uh, I, man uh, I managed to ult them, kill the Jinx, pick off some kills, uh, give some kills to the Ezreal. And uh, we managed to take off a uh, their second mid lane turret. Um, I was actually alone there uh, in that like last team fight. I don't think it was a team fight actually, they just caught me uh, outnumbered, but the bard was actually there, he was picking up his chimes. Uh, really good bard, he uh, really does have a lot of presence, I believe. 
uh, as well. My point now is to be as tanky as possible, and that's what I always try to achieve. And we're going for our second dragon, which will give us a speed buff. Um, another thing is, uh, they all went for the Garen top. Um, at this point on, the enemy team is actually trying to group themselves, but I don't really think that it's going to work out for them. Uh, we're way too much in the lead uh, <laughs> at this moment right now. Uh, the Maokai actually tries to go in, but uh, we're actually three, at, but he had the tower advantage, but either way, we weren't going to go for him. I have no idea why he ulted. Um, maybe because we kind of do, actually, we actually do uh, quite some tons of damage, so diving for the Maokai wasn't really a good idea, but his ult comes back really quickly, so I guess that's no big deal for him. Uh, the Ezreal is also backdooring bot, and the Tresh actually, uh, no, sorry, the Aryaso actually caught off the Tresh, uh, he's top right now. Um, one thing I've also noticed for myself is that I started losing a little bit of the buffs, so um, I went back to uh, get them in my jungle. They managed to pick off the Jinx, uh, Maokai comes in, um, I think... I think the Yasuo is gonna go. He's gonna dive because he currently saw me. So everybody, <laughs> but uh, the three of us actually tried going in, but uh, we couldn't get him. We got Maokai the Flash though, uh, and also got uh, their second top turret, which uh, which is a good thing. Uh, Garen and Ezreal actually at the inhibitor right now. Um, so yeah, like I said, uh, even if they group right now, they can't really handle us all. Uh, if they're separated, um, they still can't handle up, uh, handle, <laughs> and this, uh, this team I was on specifically was really salty with, uh, with the enemy team. <laughs> it's quite funny to see, actually. Um, Bard was, uh, once again, kudos to the Bard and the Ezreal as well, really both good players. Um, and as you'll notice, uh, the, the jungle is pretty much where I haven't backed since, uh, I, I believe I only backed three times or four in, in, into this game, but, um, I don't think I'll back to the very end, uh, because we're just too much in the lead right now, uh, as you can see right now, I'm level 11 and I don't have enough, uh, really don't have enough items. They Somebody pinged for Baron um, and we're heading there right now. Um, you might think that this is a bad idea, um, trying to go for, uh, for an early 20 minute Baron. Um, but no, no, actually they, they have to defend the minions. Uh, I, I think they're gonna try to catch up to us or no? No, it's gonna be a clean Baron steal. Um, yeah, it's gonna be a clean Baron steal. And uh, around this point in the game, there's uh, two minutes to go uh, until the end, and that's that's gonna be game for them. We just completely got every asset that we actually need to have. Uh, the bard went went in. Uh, couldn't quite get the E, of course, <laughs> because of the ultimate. Um, so yeah, I'm at 3k gold right now. I didn't even bother <laughs> backing. We're just way too much in the lead. And even if they manage to somehow uh, kill us, uh, they won't be able to. Uh, I'll will just be too strong for them after I mean I could I could easily buy directly buy um, the iceboard gauntlet uh, straight up and then start doing for another item another tanky item um, so yeah, right now I'm trying to uh, help around they can't really do much they're trying to defend most of what they're trying 
but it's completely futile. This is game. <laughs> um, the enemy team is is kind of it's kind of getting killed, but no, we actually. I thought I thought they were gonna die there, that they were gonna counter us, but no, no it's completely game. The only person alive right now is uh, I believe they're Jinx. I believe she DC'd. Yeah, or no, she's actually there. There we go. That's game. Uh, so once again, I played Nunu uh, in the jungle at uh, Silver Elo. Um, Right before we end this video, I'll show you, I'll leave the, uh, the runes and masteries that I was using for this game. So this has been a Cyberborgtronic video. If you enjoyed it, please remember to hit like, subscribe, and share. So thank you for watching.